Thank you for joining me for another Alex on Tech and ITY video. You can see I have with me the uh, Jot and the Loft. These are from a company called 97, and they allow you to, um, you know, do away with needing all the time this uh, particular charging uh, device. This is the one for the uh, Google Home Mini, and um, you can see here that uh, normally you've got to plug it into. Um, power, so that would have been yeah, that's the power that it's got to plug into there. And um, it, once you unplug it, there's it, it's you know can't be used. I mean that's the, the Google um, Home Mini. This is the the, the larger uh, Google Home. And what we have here are the actual devices themselves. So what I can do here is um, open this up. So there's a little piece of um, Protective tape there, and I can open this unit up. And inside, it says here uh, for questions. Uh, yeah, there's the customer support. And so open it up, and inside there is the base. So what happens here? And so there's uh, more information inside there. But what happens is that we we have this particular base, and let me pull, pull it up. And so the the Google Home, well, you can see over here. It needs to slide in and connect to that particular dot that's there and um, this is the the unit itself it's got uh, one unit of power there and it's uh, this Google home device is turning on and there's the on off and you know we obviously still need the power uh, to be able to charge this base with which has a battery inside of it so you still plug this into the base here to charge it up and once it's it's charged you can see obviously from that particular uh, display there how much battery power is left inside of the base, but this allows your Google to be completely portable and uh, and have you know several hours of battery life. So okay, Google, what time is it? The time is 10 so <laughs> I've got a different Google in a different part of the house that's answering. Okay, Google, what time is it? Now again, I've got a different. Let me go. Let me go and turn the, the the microphone on that particular unit off because otherwise it's answering for me. So one second, I'm just coming to this unit to turn off. Okay, so that other Google Home Mini is now silent. So okay, Google, what time is it? It's ten thirty-five. There we go. That's what we wanted to hear. Okay, Google, what time is it in Paris? The time in Paris, France, is two thirty-six a.m. So, I mean, I don't have this other particular side plugged into anything else at the moment. So this is just relying upon the battery power that comes with the, with the um, unit that's in here. And, you know, it comes out of the box, comes charged. But this allows me to take my um, Google Home Mini or Google Home wherever I've got a Wi-Fi connection. So I can connect this to a hotspot uh, if I'm just at home and my Wi-Fi connection stretches outside, which most Wi-Fi connections will do. I can take and I could do some gardening. I could do whatever I wanted to do and I could have my Google Home uh, there. Okay, Google, what's the weather like today? Okay, Google, what's the weather today? Today in Yarralumla, it'll be partly cloudy with a forecast high of 15 and a low of 2. Right so, now it's 11 and partly cloudy. So there you go. So that is the Google Home Mini. So this is the loft. And this is the unit for the larger Google Home device. So let me pull this out. I may have done it upside down, but ultimately it uh, doesn't matter. And there's the unit itself. So yeah, I did open it upside down. But there we go. So that is the base for the larger Google Home. And we have here a little uh, thing telling us what's inside the box. So here I can I can grab that. I can see that there's the there's the the uh, where the power goes, there it is in there. And I can just pop it inside there. Actually, oh, I've got to take the base off. There we go, take the base off. So there's all the speakers on, on the Google Home. And um, yep, yeah, pop it in there. And so now, now that is what the Google Home looks like. Here I can still plug it into the same power that I had before. And I can tap on that to see it's got two units of power. I can uh, hold it to turn it on. It's already turning on at the top there. And let us, Wait for it. Google is turning on. It's just taking its time as it normally does. So those are the two units that you can see. 
and that's what they look like. So they convert your Google Home speakers into portable Google speakers, and it just means that you can take it with you. So it's on, and uh, okay, Google, what time is it? 10.38. Now, let me see if I can uh, turn this one to off, because otherwise this is the one that's answering. The mic's off. Okay, Google, what time is it? The time is 10.38. So there you go. It is working as you would expect. Now they do tell you to only use the Google Home power adapter, but you know, that's what you'd expect. This particular one has eight hours of battery life, which is excellent. That's what it uh, is telling us uh, on the back. So pretty good, pretty amazing. And this smaller unit here, this is telling us that it also does eight hours of rechargeable cord-free mobility. So there you go. Excellent devices that Google, allow you the mic's off. to yeah. turn it back on. Slide the switch on the back of Google Home. Yeah, well, that's because I have turned it off. So I'm going to leave these units plugged in and, um, yeah, very nifty idea from a company that whose name almost sounds like nifty, but it's 1997. Nifty 797. <laughs> so you can get these at uh, the regular stores in Australia. I'll have the prices in the in the website, but they work absolutely as advertised, and um, that is great. Back on. Okay, Google, thank you very much. I'm happy to help. Okay, Google, thank you. No dramas. <laughs> okay, thanks very much.